obviously with AI, we're creating something in our own image. But whenever something is an image of another, it's always very partial. I mean, if we think about how in the Judeo-Christian tradition, we are created in the image of God, but we are not gods, you know, therefore we have to ask the question, well, then what is it in us that images God? You know, what part of God are we Im imaging, knowing that we can never image the whole thing? AI is exactly the same. It is an image of ourselves, but obviously it's a very partial image. Um, in many ways, one could say it images the left brain quite well. It has, you know, uh, large language models are handling language. Um, other programs handle calculations, numbers, that kind of thing. Um, but there's a, a whole lot of being human that is right brained our emotions yeah. our uh, artistic creativity um our feelings for for one another um these are not being well imaged in ai and then of course the other thing is as much as we would like it, to forget it and think that we can live online we are embodied creatures we have a body, we are a body, and AI is not. Um, so it cannot feel pain, cannot also feel joy the way we can in an embodied way. Um, it is not mortal the way we are. Um, it does not age or grow the way we do. Um, and so the whole part of ourselves that acknowledges our embodiment and our embodiment within a larger environment is missing from AI.